A magnitude 3.6 earthquake shook Ontario and parts of Metro Detroit last night, especially downriver. Viewers called us saying they could feel the earth shake. That brings us to today's poll question. Did you feel the earthquake? Yes or no? You can vote right now on our website at WXYZ.com slash vote. We'll have the results for you in a few. But first, our Andrea Isom headed up to the U of M to get a little lesson about earthquakes. So we came here to U of M to get the breakdown on the recent earthquake that rocked Metro Detroit. I learned a lot and I think you will too. You hear the word earthquake and people seem to perk up. Quite frankly, tremors are not usually the talk of the town around these parts. But one is sure making headlines now, a 3.6 magnitude. Huang, I'm an assistant professor in geophysics from the University of Michigan. When it comes to an earthquake expert, she is it. Did you know that there's an earthquake somewhere around the world every single day? This is the break, so you see this offset right here. Mm -hmm. So this is what we call the earthquake. It just happens within seconds. Is a 3.6 a big one in the big scheme of things? Well, I'm sure it caused some concerns because, you know, you do feel the motions, you feel that's real, you know, you think maybe something bigger will come, you know, that's maybe the fear that people may have. But I don't think, you know, this will be the case here because, you know, it's still like once a year we have seen this kind of earthquake, but they are usually very small. Well, what happened in Ontario did not stay in Ontario. A lot of folks felt the reaction right here in the D. So we have the break with the motion travels and yeah. and then that's when we feel the motion. That's right. Okay. We feel the motion. Mm -hmm. That's right. Well, see there, you learn something new every day, but it always helps to have a really good teacher. In Ann Arbor, I'm Andrea Isom, 7 Action News. Andrea, thanks. So we asked if you felt the earthquake last night and 46% uh, of you said yes, while 54% uh, of you said no, you didn't feel anything. We thank you for voting as always in our online polls. Glenda. All right.